There is no trust for Cap. They'll never see you coming. No can I assist? Hmm? To one sense. No signs of any dragon right now, but it sure looks like he's been here. I know it looks bad, but we've got to figure out what happened, and if that dragon is still skulking around somewhere. Spread out, and look for survivors. We need to know what we're feeling. Rocky and Tor just got grabbed when they tried to make a run for it. Kidrath, save us. Here he comes again. Here he comes. Find cover and make every arrow count.
welcome to you, fellow traveler. Everybody, get back! Taught that dragon not to mess with White Run, didn't we? That was the hairiest fight I've ever been in, and I've been in more than a few. I don't know about this Dragonborn. I can't believe it. I'm sure glad you are Dragonborn. Get back to White Run right away. In the very oldest Dark tales, Dark back from when there were still dragons in Skyrim, the Dragonborn would slay dragons and steal their power. That's what you did, isn't it? Absorb the dragon's power. There's only one way to find out. Try to shout. That would prove it. According to the old legends, only the Dragonborn can shout without training, the way the dragons do. Dragon? What are you talking about? That's right. My grandfather. Oh, God. What matter of power is that? Those born with the dragon blood in them. Like old Tiber Septon himself. I've never heard of Tiber Septon killing any dragons. There weren't any dragons then, idiot. They're just coming back now for the first time in forever. But the old tales tell of the dragonborn who can kill dragons and steal the power. You must be one. What do you say, Irina? You're being awfully quiet. Come on, Irina. Tell us. Do you believe in this dragonborn business? <laughs> Some of you would be better off keeping quiet than flapping your gums on matters you don't know anything about. Here's a dead dragon, and that's something I definitely understand. Now we know we can kill them. But I don't need some mythical dragonborn. Someone who can put down a dragon is more than enough for me. You wouldn't understand, Housecar. You ain't a norm. I've been all across Tamriel. I've seen plenty of things just as outlandish as this. I'd advise you all to trust in the strength of your sword arm over tales and legends. That was shouting, what you just did. Must be. You really are Dragonborn, then. Boom! Oh, that like one's sick. That's a shout. Like the Greybeards on the mountain. I'm taking command here for the moment. You head back to Whiterun and let the Jarl know what happened. You did it! Turn around and go back dragon. the way you came. We're There's been talk amongst the guards. I work with my mother. Those green apples you sold me the other day were delicious. You look a bit. Aren't they? I always set some aside for myself. That's a nice enough little hamlet for a boring post. <laughs> disrespect the law, and you disrespect me. Good, you're finally here. The Jarl's been waiting for you. You heard. So, what happened at the watchtower? Was the dragon there? I knew I could count on Irileth. But there must be more to it than that. So it's true. The Grey Beards really were summoning you. Ma 
masters of the way of the voice. They live in seclusion, high on the slopes of the throat of the world. The Dragonborn is said to be uniquely gifted in the voice. The ability to focus your vital essence into a thum or shout. If you really are Dragonborn, they can teach you how to use your gift. The Greybeards. Didn't you hear the thundering sound as you returned to Whiterun? That was the voice of the Greybeards, summoning you to High Rothgar. This hasn't happened in centuries, at least. Not since Tybiseptim himself was summoned when he was still Talos of Atmora. Rangar, calm yourself. What does any of this Nord nonsense have to do with our friend here? Capable as he may be, I don't see any signs of him being this, what, Dragonborn. Nord nonsense? Why, you puffed up ignorant. These are our sacred traditions that go back to the founding of the First Empire. Rongar, don't be so hard on Avenich. I meant no disrespect, of course. It's just that, what do these Greybeards want with him? That's the Greybeards. Well, well. Never Another magic slaughter. No sign of it. Whatever happened when you killed that dragon, it revealed something. You tried mercenary work? It might suit you. Good. You're finally here. The Yarl's been So what happened you. at the Watchtower? Was the dragon there? Dragonborn? What do you know? So it's true. Masters of the... The dra... If you re... You've done a great serve. By my right as Jarl, I name you Thane of Whiterun. It's the greatest honor that's within my power to grant. I assign you Lydia as a personal housecarl, and this weapon from my armory to serve as your badge of office. I'll also notify my guards of your new title. Wouldn't want them to think you're part of the common rabble, now would we? We are honored to have you as Thane of our city, Dragonborn. The Greybeards. Didn't you hear the thundering sound as you returned to Whiterun? That was the voice of the Greybeards, summoning you to High Rothgar. This hasn't happened in centuries, at least. Not since Tybiseptim himself was summoned when he was still Talos of Atmora. Rangar, calm yourself. What does any of this Nord nonsense have to do with... I serve Jarl Balgrub as steward. Splendid. There's a house available right now. Wonderful. Here's the key to your new home. Near as I can tell, a bunch of ancient Nord hermits who live on top of a mountain. Never heard of them talking to anybody before. If they really do want to talk to you, you'd better go find out what they want. You never know. Cape